Hey guys, my game's Luma Gamer here, just about to start a game of Factorio. I have been I have done this a little bit on my Twitch stream back whenever I did it a little bit. So I have played it a little bit and I thought I would do a little bit on YouTube here. So let's go ahead and get going with it. I am going to do rich resources, um, which basically means richness is very good. Um, I'm going to leave everything else the same and uh, yeah. Let's go ahead and generate preview. Usually I'm pretty good with what the previews look like, but I just want to double check. That is a lot of iron. That's actually pretty good, and the amount of that, and it looks like we have a little bit of water next to some coal over there. Sweet, with a huge vein of stone. That is very good, so let's go ahead and get in on it. And... Yeah, um, I will be doing this the first time here. Um, this is a, an achievement. Um, I don't really like to say the last word there, so I'm going to just say a lazy guy. Um, but I will say, let's go ahead and get on it. Um, so we have, what that achievement is, is basically where you have to win the game, but uh, without crafting anything else other than 111 items manually. So I want to keep track of that, and I have it up there. Once I get fully automated automation going, I will be fine. But I do need to get going on the automation as soon as possible. The first thing that I need to make is um, an iron axe, just to get one piece of coal. I probably don't have to do that, but it is a little bit faster. Um, yeah, I probably did not have to do that. Anywho, um, the first thing that I have to make is the boiler, steam engine, electric, or not the electric mining drill. We can get that going later, but we do need to make the offshore pump. So, um, don't have to make any more stone furnaces because once we get the automation going, once we get this guy, we can start that process, or we can make some more of those, so I don't have to worry about that. Now, this is making some coal. I won't have to worry about that there. The first thing that I should probably work on is getting the lab is the first thing we need, but before that, the offshore pump, steam engine, and boiler. I'm going to go ahead and gra gather. Uh, I'd rather gather. There we go. I'd rather gather some more car. Um, need to get this over. Okay. There we go. All right, there we go. Now, what we have to do, I'll go ahead and gather up some resources here and um, I'll be back. Just getting some copper now. And now some iron. Also, uh, while I was um, gaining some copper, I wanted to uh, tell what we need in resource items. We need 36 um, iron for this, 15 if you look down in about this area. Uh, you'll see 36 iron, 15 copper. We need 5 and 3 respectively here. Um, 31 only of iron, so we need um, 31, 36, so uh, that would be 72. And we need four here, so 76 iron total here. So we do need quite a bit of iron on these notes. Uh, we also need to make 10 of these. If you take a look at this, we need 10 science packs, science pack ones, and a science pack requires two iron per. If we need 10, or uh, if we need 10 of these, then we'll need 20 of those. So we'll need 96 iron plates for getting automation going. Quite a bit, to be honest, but I have 18 right now. 96, here we come. Well, I do have four here, but 96 total, here we come. Let's go ahead and get on it, and I will go ahead and say what we need in copper now. We need 15 here, uh, three here, and none here, none here. So um, 15 and three is 18. And then we need a total of 10 here, so 28 total. We have 29, so we have just enough on those. 
which is good. Um, all right, so I'm going to go ahead and start crafting up some of these items with these, like one of those. Um, I do need a few more of those. Personally, it does take quite a bit of crafting to be able to craft all of this. But yeah, I'll go ahead and get these crafted up and I'll be right back. All right, so I switched back over to doing some more copper, co copal, Ugh. coal, I mean copper, that's what I mean, copper. Um, I switched back over to doing some more copper. I did realize that I did need to have a little bit of stone. Thankfully, we have a little bit right here. I think this gives about 20, maybe 25, something like that, uh, 24. Awesome. So I'm able to make this guy pretty easily. And then we need to make all but one of these, um, which we can do right now. But we have everything that we need on one of these. So let's go ahead and make that. And perfect. All 10 of those. Perfecto. Let's go ahead and just take these two down and come over here and set up this guy. And the place that I am going to pop it up, um, I would like it here because I think it would work well going down this way. Um, yeah, I, that's going to be where I would like it. I'm going to put it here for now because this guy is going to go here, this guy here, this one up here. How? What? How? How did... Okay, that was weird. That was a glitch. Okay, so that one can go right there. This one I'll put here just to connect these two. Uh, let's go ahead and put a bit of coal in here to power this guy. And pop those... Hey, that was perfect timing, my man. Uh, that finished just as I was needing all of them. Alright, so now all of these will produce the automation and when the automation is done I will be right back. Alright, we are done with the automation now. Let's go ahead and hop over to making this one. We need 30 and then this one needs 80. Woo wee. Alright, so let's go ahead and start in on this guy. Now what we need to build this thing is going to be nine iron plates, five iron gear wheels, and three electronic circuits. Unfortunately, we do need to build all of them ourselves. So, there's that. I think I've done pretty good on keeping it pretty low key. Not the, um, not Thor's brother, but low key. Um, so we have to make five, eight, ten. Yeah, we can still do that. Um, and that, I'll replace this guy. Actually, let's replace this and put it over here instead. There we go. And I have these being pretty much done. Let's go ahead and do a little bit more of that. We need a total of 4.5, which we have 14. We just need 22 iron now. Uh, let's go ahead and actually do it down here. This looks like a good spot. And throw Half of these in. There we go. All right, and now once we get iron going here, we should be able to get 22 very quickly. All right, I'll be right back when that's done. All right, uh, sorry about this. Uh, I actually ran out of time uh, between a couple of the ep uh, recordings and I didn't realize it until after I was done. So, um, instead of doing an in-game ending, I decided to do it here. Thank you for watching episode number one of Factorio.